Well, hello, new child. I haven't seen you before, but you come at a crucial time. South Park is sliding into moral decline. Someone's stealing our cats. They're peeing houses. Okay, maybe it's not full on Armageddon yet, but we do need a hero. Not to make the hard sell, but do you see yourself as a good person? Well, I can understand the confusion, but there comes a time when we need to choose our path. Will you find Jesus and take the righteous path? Or maybe you'll walk the middle way. Let's not talk about the third alternative. I'm hoping you're part of the solution, not the problem. Take the first step, my child, by entering this meditative chamber, which will allow you to confront your deepest fears. Face your fears, new child. Face your fears. Your dad fucked your mom. You afraid of the dark? Snakes? The color blue? Ooh. Oh, hey. I'm in your imagination. Just a friendly Catholic priest who would like to get to know you a little better. Yeah, that's right. I'm totally in your imagination, too. About to give you a shoulder rub. Ever imagine you'd feel something like this? Let me adjust the lighting in here a bit so we can get some visuals with that. Oh, I guess this one likes it rough. No complaints here. God's grace is totally filling me. What the devil vanished into thin air? Mmm. Oh my. Huh. Don't you want to go to heaven with me? Warmed up. Mm. Oh, I like that. Oh, who wants to hold hands and sing Kumbaya with me? Where'd that kid disappear to? <laughs> ah. Here, little kitty, come out and play. Hoping you'd welcome this chance to atone. I've got God's love here. Who am I gonna give it to? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, who wants to hold hands and sing Kumbaya with me? Ah. Don't you want to go to heaven with me? Without you bastards showing up. Well, you're definitely going to hell now. Get out of here! That's not what the Queen Spider says. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'll go say 10 Mel Harry's. Well, gosh, I feel just awful about all that. Tell you what, a rabbi friend gave me this macaroni picture. In times of trouble and tribulation, use it to call upon the prophet Moses. Good luck on your spiritual journey, my child. The Lord giveth, and the Lord taketh a selfie. How about it? <laughs> Bless you, new child. Remember when Morgan Freeman was God? Oh, yeah, I remember. Remember when Christians cared about the sick and the poor? Sure, I mean it. Take like ten selfies a day. Sweet. Okay, sure, I'll take a pic. Yay, thanks. Okay, but no screwing around. Well. Okay, then. Okay, now don't go screwing around. Come back tomorrow, eh? Oh, hi, you're the new kid, right? Oh, great, thanks for coming. Have a seat. As your counselor, you can talk to me about anything, okay? I understand you want to talk about sex. Okay, see, I'm highly trained in um, uh, sex issues, okay? And you don't have to be afraid. Okay, new kid, it's, it's really simple. When, uh, when you want to talk about your sex, you simply... You can start by simply saying, you know, I'm, I'm a boy or a girl or other. A 
Boy, right, exactly, you got it. Now, new kid, this might get confusing, but listen close, okay? If you were born a boy, that's called being a cisgender boy, okay? Or cis for short. But, well, you, you might have transitioned into being a boy. You see what I mean? If you were not born a boy, but now a... Uh, I identify as one, well, that's called being transgendered, okay? Or trans for short. Okay. So, um, do you identify as being cisgendered or transgendered? Okay, can you just hang on a minute? I need to call your parents. Let's just take a second. Uh, hello, this is Mr. Mackey, the school counselor. Yes, hi. Uh, I have your child here in my office, and well, He's just let me know that he's cisgender. That means he identifies with the sex he was assigned at birth. Oh, you knew that? Okay. Well, no, no, it's it's fine. I just wanted to make sure that you knew he had other options. You know, you don't you don't always have to go with the first hand you're dealt. Huh? Okay. Yeah, no, that's that's great. That's great to know. Uh, I think I can really maybe be of help from here on out. Uh, thank you very much. Okay. Bye bye now. Okay. Well, I'm really glad we had this talk. As a cisgendered male myself, I know how hard it can be out there for a boy who chooses to love someone of the opposite sex. Just remember, love is love. Even if you're a guy who happens to like titties. <laughs> Just be careful, okay? Because there's, there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are, and then you're going to have to deal with them, okay? So, uh, but come see me anytime. Christmas break seems so far away. School's over, kid. Why are you still hanging around? Well, well, well. If it ain't a cisgendered boy. We don't take kindly to your types around here. Let's welcome this thing to our town. I'm gonna punch you straight, just like I did Dale that one night in 94. Everyone try to keep up. 